know so many people comment on my wig videos and they ask me about what it's like wearing them out and about and is it uncomfortable and things like that and to be honest I have only wore my wigs outside a handful of times and that was only for photo shoots. When I first had my hair incident I decided that I was going to rock the short hair and own up to my mistake basically. At that point I decided to wear wigs for videos, wear wigs for photo shoots and just things like that but I've never worn a wig as like an everyday thing. So I have a wig that I got a while ago from Uniwigs and I am opening it for the first time to wear it for you guys and for everybody else that's gonna see it today. So it looks like we have a long lace front brown to blonde wig. Oh my god, this is beautiful. Oh my god! So I'm just gonna cut the lace and we're gonna put it on and see what it looks like before everyone else sees what it looks like. Oh my god. So we got our wig caps on. I'm emotionally preparing myself to wear this wig for an awfully long amount of time. Oh, 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 oh my god, oh my god, wow, oh my god, I feel good about this, oh my god, I could wear this, I could wear this all day. Koda, what do you think? Do I look cute? He says no. I am going to put some concealer on the crease, make it look a little bit more natural, and then we can run some errands and uh, see how many looks we get, you know? Oh God. So this is the final product. I put concealer on there. I plucked it out a little bit and then I put it to the side because I noticed a new pet peeve of mine is um, when I have hair in my face. I was gonna bring my best friend Coda, but you know, that would just be a lot to have to like carry him around and you have to keep a wig on. And um, apparently he really likes biting it so if it came off in public I don't know what I would do actually no it would, it would probably just be very chill I would be like haha ha. anyways yeah so I'm sorry buddy you got to stay home um it's raining and uh, I'm sure this wig is gonna be fine what a perfect day to wear a wig am I right oh oh look we're killing it we're killing it in this wig game <sighs> so far so good you know we made a clean break no one saw us yet okay to be honest like what could go wrong so where is the number one place people go to people watch? Walmart. You know, if anything, I think people would just look at me weird for like filming myself. Oh, I'm, I almost got run over. So far, um, yeah, some people have looked at me, but they're mainly looking at me because of my camera being out. Maybe it's maybe it's the hood. Ooh, she's out for everyone to see. Hi, good. Other than my hair being in my face a lot, you know, being out with a wig, not too bad. How about, let's try like a makeup store. Like let's go where people know what looks are, you know? I have hair in my mouth. What's like a really good highlighter? It is really pretty. And it's too. Yeah. Like, like, take a bar bus, like, oh, Oh my god, you can have one too. I wish I was filming. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. I didn't even film it. So we're just having like a great conversation. One of the girls is like, oh, I like your tattoo on the back of my neck. You know, the scissors one, you know? And I was like, thanks. And the other girl was like, yeah, I saw that. Um, are you a hairstylist? And I was like, no, I'm not actually. My hair is actually um, uh, not uh, real. And they were like, what? And I'm like, yeah, no, I'm I'm like wearing a wig right now. And they were both like stunned. For some reason, they were like, yeah. Like, they just, they saw all this and I don't think they really like analyzed this, of course. Like, they didn't really analyze it and think like, hmm, is she wearing a wig or not? They were actually like stunned. So, huh, huh, what a time to be alive, you know? Where should we go next? Now we're on trip number three. We are at the grocery store. Um, let's see what some hungry people say about my hair, if they say anything at all. OK, 
Okay, the wind is not my friend. I guess that's kind of it. Well, nothing really happened. I mean, no one looked at me weird at all. Like, no one even looked at me. Which is great. I love not being looked at. So I'm just gonna head home and then I'll catch up with you guys there. So basically, in the end, what I learned was that people don't care. And even if they do notice, it's not like they're gonna say anything. I guess something different probably would have happened if I lived in a smaller town. If, um, if maybe I ran into like a friend or someone that I had met before, maybe they would ask like, oh, that's a nice wig or, you know. But I can't imagine anyone would really come up to me and say something rude, you know. Because, you know, if they do, then it's kind of like... <laughs> Do you hear yourself? So with wearing a wig all day, it's kind of like wearing like a fit hat in the sense of like the pressure being on your head, you know? So right now I'm getting like a little bit of a headache just from it like squeezing my head all day. So even with like the rain and the wind and everything, it didn't move at all up here, but I was afraid of the ends and if it was gonna get really tangled or not. So if you guys wear wigs all day every day and you think I did something wrong, or if you just wanna talk about your own experiences, make sure to comment down below. Keep the conversations going down there, guys, because at the end of the day, wigs should not be something to hide behind and you should feel insecure wearing a wig or not wearing a wig so as long as you rock you that's all that matters thank you guys so much for watching my video today make sure to tweet it out so you get a shout out on next week's video and I will see you guys next time bye are you good <laughs>